We're doing our annual meet and greet with Bill Tiberio on Jazz Street. Bill, here we go again. We're back. Really, really glad to be here again. You know what, we've been playing a lot of one of your former students, Mike MacArthur, and he was just going on and on about how much you mean to him in terms of forming him as a person and as a musician. Talk about that effect you have as a, as a teacher can have on students and how far that can go. Because it happened to you, obviously. You passed it on right. from there. Well, specifically with Mike, Mike is, uh, he graduated from Fairport High School in 1993. And he's somebody that I, I was able to, I, I think I gave him one of his very first lessons on jazz improvisation, probably when he was in fifth grade, sixth grade followed his career through junior high school and high school. He's just somebody that has never forgotten any of the people that helped him along the way. And so since he graduated from high school, we've stayed in touch really regularly. We're very good friends now. We've played together quite a bit. Um, his, his record is called um, Feels, like Home. Feels Like Home, and it just was released about three months ago. It's doing really well on the contemporary jazz charts, and I'm just incredibly proud of him. He lives in Florida now. He's going to be coming up to Rochester, and my rhythm section and I are going to back him up on uh, July 20th at uh, Loving Cup on his tunes, on his record. And then he's playing the next day with Peter White at Glenora. So he's with some of the heavier acts in, in the contemporary jazz scene, and I couldn't be prouder of him. And when you do connect with a student like that who's so talented, and and the wealth of talent that students have, not just in the area that you teach them, but, but students as people, it's a gift to be involved with them. And Mike is somebody that's always paid that gift back to me. Bill, who are some of the teachers that really influenced you to follow this direction? Interesting that you mentioned that because one of my, my legends, uh, heroes, just passed away this year at age 91. His name was Waldo Woodworth. He was my first teacher. I played clarinet all the way through high school and then I picked up saxophone in my senior year. Um, he was my first teacher and he really, really inspired me to, to love music. And I stayed in touch with him a little bit after high school, and he moved to Florida. I actually went to high school with one of his kids. Um, but he was just a tremendous influence on me. And I would also mention that teachers along the way, I had another man named Tom Gadu, who taught VJ Iyer, whom we were just talking about. You know, we had some really great students that we have graduated from Fairport High School through the years. Tom was uh, my jazz ensemble director when I was a senior in high school, and, and just a wonderful friend and mentor. And then since then, I had just great associations with wonderful teachers, including people like Fred Sturm. Fred's son, Ike, is playing at about two minutes down at uh, Harrow East with New York Voices. He's a wonderful bass player out of New York City. Fred taught at Eastman School of Music for 11 years, and he's now out at Lawrence University, where he's from in, in uh, Wisconsin. A tremendous mentor and teacher. Even though I didn't attend Eastman, I was a, an unofficial student of his for lots of years. Yeah. Phil, again, we can't thank you enough for the years of dedication and service you brought to the community of jazz and the world of jazz. Oh, it's been a pleasure. Today I had an opportunity to put together a group of Rochester area students that have just graduated in the last year or so. Now a lot of them are out at music schools going to do, doing either a jazz degree or a music ed degree. We rehearsed one hour yesterday and then we just got a chance to play on this stage and these guys were just terrific, terrific players. They blew the, they blew the roof off the place. That was a treat. That was a treat. Thanks so much again, my man. Thanks, Derek. Great right. seeing you again. Great seeing you.